Hi, welcome to Frema Shows. Today we are going to make Rare Realm coin. Yes, yes, yes. So we have our garlic ginger and onion. I'm gonna add grove, fresh tomatoes, tomato paste, cayenne pepper, salt, and I have my red red right here. And this is the meat we are going to use. So you may wonder why I have fresh onion there because I'm going to use it to steam the meat as well. So let me blend the ginger, garlic, and then onions and my grove. I'm gonna use one tablespoon of grove and I'll be right back with you. All right, so I get my ginger, onions, and garlic blend. Let's put everything together. This is the ginger, garlic, onion, and grove. I'm going to throw it into the pan. All right. I'm gonna have two tablespoons of cayenne pepper. I'm gonna have one tablespoon of salt. Three tablespoons of tomato paste. Get everything in let me turn it to high heat i'm going to this onion i'm going to blend it later so i'm going to add it to steam as well i'm going to put all the meat into my saucepan this is percase all right i will reserve the the bony fish which is amani i'll reserve it later when i'm about to put the tomatoes in then i'll put my bony fish in as well okay so don't go nowhere Let's leave everything to steam. I'm going to steam it for about 30 minutes because everything here, it takes a long time for it to steam. So um, I'll get back to you. Let me kick a it covered. And everything is going to boil. Don't go nowhere, I'll be right back. Let's see how it's doing right now. Whew. It's nice and steamy, fantastic. We are going to leave it in a low heat for about 30 minutes before we put our next procedure. But before I put the Amane, which is um, then the tomatoes, I'll show you so that you know what time to put it in. I didn't put it into steaming it because it's not necessary to do so, and I want to be able to have the amani on top of my food. So don't go nowhere. Stay tuned. It's been 20 minutes. Let's see how it looks. Mm. Let's give it 10 minutes more, okay? Before we add our next ingredient and before I even um, so. Let's leave it for 15 minutes. 10 more minutes, please. Okay, it's 30 minutes total right now. Let's see how it looks. Woo, nice and beautiful steaming. Mm, perfect. So I'm going to put my fresh tomatoes and also it's pre wash my amani. Also. And we are going to. We're going to work on the rare very soon, okay? All right, let's leave it to steam for about 10 minutes more before we do anything. Stay tuned, don't go nowhere. Since we are getting to the end of the part of it, so we're going to steam our, um, I don't know what I'm gonna call it, fly, or we're going to, okay, let's say fry or roast our <laughs> rare, okay? So I just switched the banner. I switched the soup into this one, you know, so that the meat will still be steaming once we are working uh, on the, our rare, rare. You can get this on any African market if you're in abroad, or you can also get it online. Yeah, you can. So I'm going to steam this for 10 minutes. Then 10 minutes, we will come back to blend it and we put it together. It doesn't take long. I know it's been a long time since you have rare if you live in abroad, but we that we're in Ghana, we make it all the time. And this is the easiest way to make it if you are. You don't need to match it and pound it and do everything. You can just do it simple way. So I'm going to stir this so until it's a little bit brownish, you know, halfway, but please don't burn it. <laughs> don't go nowhere. I'll be right back. Okay, so far this is how it looks. 
you can tell it's roast, right? Yeah, you can tell the brown. Yeah, that's how you know it's ready. And when it's really light, it's like pop, pop, pop. Then it started going out. <laughs> All right, so I'm gonna turn it off and we are going to blend it. Let me turn the heat off. Actually, I'm going to, okay, let me turn the heat off. Then join me right here. All right, so I'm going to put everything in a blender, okay? I have everything in a blender. I'm going to add two cups of water, just any regular cup. Water. Okay. All right. I'm going to blend it. This is the drainer I'm going to use. Make sure you have something like this. Don't use the big one. And use this one here. Can see it? Use it to because and yes, I and you're gonna be cool. All right. So we pause it and blend it for the because of the noise. All right. It's now fully blend. Stick it up. Okay. Yeah, it's nice and warm. All right. So what I'm going to do? I'm going to take the middle part out of my blender. If you have the one that it stays in, that's fine. But if it doesn't, please take it off before you mess everything up. All right. So I'm going to drain it in my first drainer right here. Okay. I'm going to add a bit of water to make sure that some of the ingredients are in. Okay, that's the first part. All right. I'm going to put it back into my blender and blend it again to make sure I get all the food from the seed in, okay? So this is the first, let's do it again. Okay, the first part, before I add the second one, this is what we're going to do. Okay, this is the, the milk that came from the first one. So I'm going to drain it again to make sure that there is no access going to the soup. Look at how it came out, right? Yeah, just a little bit, okay. Now let's do the, the second part and that's it. You can blend it as much as you want, okay? It doesn't have to be two, but I'm just gonna do two because I'm using Ninja Blender and it doesn't take long. So let's drain it. This is our second part look. This is how much milk I came up with. So I've drained it as much as I can and I'm going to throw this away and raise it and I'll be right back. Don't go nowhere. So with the second part, I'm going to, even though I've drained it here, I'm still going to do it on top of the meat as well to make sure that it doesn't have any access in it. Ooh. <laughs> Look at how beautiful it looks. Look at that. Look at that. Okay. So we're going to leave it to cook for about 10 minutes and we're going to blend our fresh um, tomatoes and also the onion that we put it in. We're going to blend it. Don't go nowhere. So I just took the the onion and tomatoes out. I'm going to blend it and we add it to the soup. All right, let's add it to our soup. That's the tomatoes and onion. All right, so we're going to leave it to um, boil for, we'll see about 10 minutes and the soup is ready. Yeah, it's ready, so don't go nowhere, okay? Stay tuned. Okay, finally, this is how it looks. Soup is ready, soup is ready. I get my fufu right here. I cook it, so let me serve. <laughs> okay. I told you it's not hard to do it. It's very easy. If you're living abroad, you want to do it. Yes, you can find all the ingredients in African market. My name is Remain Prima Shows. I do want to thank you for watching, and I'll see you next time. This is Rare Realm Queen and Fufu. <laughs> Thank you for watching. I'll see you next time. It's bye-bye for me.